Hi, I'm Peter Modio with Customer Application Support for Video Brand. I'd like to uh, talk to you about the Ranger tooling today that we get a lot of calls on for face grooving. So what I'll do here is show you um, how to adjust the Ranger uh, for the appropriate size. Okay, I'm going to offer some directions here on on how to adjust the Ranger. It's a common question that we get over our customer application support line. Okay, first thing you need to do is identify what is the face grooving diameter that you're um, putting into your part. Um, we're going, these dimensions we show on this cartridge are would be your uh, major diameter or your outside diameter on your part itself. So if you have a two and a quarter inch diameter face groove, major diameter or OD diameter, you're going to set this tool to 2.25 this line on the cartridge with the bottom line on the tool holder. Okay, say we want to adjust this cartridge to four inch diameter range. This four inch diameter on, has a line right here and we're going to line it up with the middle line on the tool holder. So as you're going to see here, it's just small movements. There, that's it. That's set for four inch diameter range right now. The next thing I would do is bring in the wrench and tighten it up. Okay, let's take it up to the top line here, 11 to 16 inch diameter range. So it's just small movements, incremental movements, 5 inch, 6 inch, 8 inch, then the 10 inch line is lined up with the next to the top line, and now 11 to 16 is lined up with the top line on the, on the holder now. Now that we got that in place, we come in, and we're going to tighten this down. So we're going to take the screw here and okay, got it. All right, so we got it set for 11 to 16 inch diameter range. Um, if you have any additional questions on the Rangers, uh, we also have the round shank Ranger as well. It just the same way. It's got the same diameters on here and lines. Uh, please give us a call on our customer application support line at 1-888-539-5145. Thank you.